Eight people are without a home after a fire broke out in Aromas early this morning. That fire now contained to a lumber yard near Quarry Road in Aromas. You can see the flames burning in that yard tonight. We do know a school in the area had to close for the day. And as Ki and Scott Rage shows us, for many, this fire came way too close to home. From the air and on the ground, firefighters battling this fire in Aromas. Perched from above, Cal Fire keeping a close watch over the flames, the fire tearing through this lumber yard Tuesday morning. Neighbors also keeping a close eye on the flames. Phil Diocampo has lived here for 10 years. He was preparing for the worst. We just got everything ready, as in the hoses, got the water on, had to hose down the houses and just everything near us just to make sure that there's no flying embers that would scorch. And right. we're on high alert at all times. The fire producing four Texas of smoke. The fire not only burning wood. And there was black smoke telling us that it was probably a structure burn or something. In all, unfortunately, two homes were destroyed and eight people displaced. Phil describes what he heard. It sounded like fireworks at first, but you didn't hear any crackling sounds afterwards. Now, Cal Fire telling me that they're letting this fire burn itself out. I'm standing at the front entrance to the Aromas Water District maintenance yard. That's where this fire is burning. As I step out of the way, you can see how hot this fire is burning. Cal Fire, again, just letting this fire burn itself out. They have set up those fire lines and you can see as I pan right over here, here is Cal Fire. There are a bunch of crews out here monitoring this, making sure there are no wind shifts and making sure that this fire doesn't get through those fire lines and spread to these nearby houses. From above, you can see the lit lumber and the smoke rising. Back on the ground, PG&E also monitoring the situation. Phil says, I just hope the wind wasn't blowing toward our direction, which was at the time because there was gusty winds and we were just concerned if the fire was going to grow bigger from that point. And I did check with Cal Fire. They tell me that it could take days for this fire to burn itself out. Reporting in Aromas, Scott Rates, KION News Channel 46. And we checked too. No one was hurt in the fire. The cause of it still under investigation at this time.